Welcome back to another episode of Progressive Rescues Web Training. I'm Mike Donahue. What we're talking about today is a five space rigging operations for a vertical entry. What we're using here is a tripod. What it is, basically it's a mobile overhead anchor device. Tripods come with these nice pre-installed eye bolts or welded attachment points for the purposes of rigging. Well, we're going to utilize one, that being dead center. We're going to utilize that for our up and down, rescuing in the vessel, out of the vessel. Two ways we can do that. First being a mechanical advantage system. Four to one here, you can use a five to one, but that being the max. You could also use a brake bar rack. The biggest difference is with that brake bar rack, you're limited to only lowering operation. You can only lower the rescuer into the hull. You gotta get the rescuer out of the hull, you have to have a pre-rigged system piggyback onto that lowering line, get the rescuer back out. By utilizing this four to one or five to one, whatever you may choose, we can lower the rescuer down, bring the rescuer back up, nothing needs to be changed. The added benefit to using a mechanical advantage is, say halfway down, your ideal laser goes through the roof, something happens, it could be medically, who knows, the rescuer needs to get out in a hurry, not a big deal. Start hauling up, the rescuer's out. It's simple. Now we'll work left to right. Belay number one, simple 540 belay. Belay number two, tandem prusas. Anytime anybody's on rope, victim, rescuer, they got to have a belay. Now we're going to plan, okay, remember two in, two out. So in the event there's a rig operation, we need to get two more rescuers into that hole, we have two belays pre-rigged ready to go. Belay one and belay two. All our belays go to separate bomb-proof anchor attachment points. That being, if this tripod should get kicked over, should fail, whatever, our belays, our rescuers, they're still safe. Worst case scenario, we have to piggyback a haul system onto our belay line to get the rescuer and the victim out. If we had everything connected to this tripod, we lost a tripod, that's it, we lost our operation. Now it's chaos. So by utilizing those separate anchor attachment points for our belays, we can avoid a lot of problems. We also have here what's called the Kootenai pulley or not passing pulley. It's nice and wide. We can fit our airlines and communication lines through them. I wrapped some nice Prusa cord around the leg of the tripod. By means of a beaner, I connect it to the Kootenai pulley. It pulls it back a little bit. I also left a nice loop here to get and pass those lines through because it'll pull everything away from that hole, that entry point. You want to keep that clutter free, open, so that when that rescuer and a victim are coming out, there's no entanglement hazards. If you're not using it, pull it away. Keep it out of the way. The name of the game is keeping your rigging simple, safe, effective, and efficient. The more organized it is, the more success you're going to have. If there's a problem, you can spot it. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next time.